we encourage you to do is to live a counterbalanced life. I mean, nothing is in balance 100%. So in a seminar environment, we ask people to stand up on one foot, just to get them kind of up on their feet and get them engaged. Then we ask the question, are you balanced? Are you balancing? And anybody who's achieved extraordinary success in their lifetime will tell you that success is a balancing act. A good example is you come home from work, you pet the dog, you help your kids with your homework, you kiss your wife, you go out in the backyard, you throw the ball with them, you go out to dinner. You're supposed to go short in your personal life. Now, in your work life, though, because it's time on task over time, when you choose and make the decision to go long, meaning focus four hours on your one thing, that one levered activity that's going to move the needle in your organization an extraordinary success begins to show up. This is where that inability to say no comes into play with a lot of people. So Gary made it pretty clear in the book as to some specific strategies. I want to give you one more. Build a bunker, meaning create a space where you can go. Nobody else can bother you. Store provisions, because if you're like me, the second you step out of your office, you get what I call sniped, right? Where you have <laughs> people rush up to you and they say, Hey, can I ask you a quick question? Here, let me walk with you, right? A three-minute trip to the restroom turns into a 15-minute distraction, right? So we want to store provisions. We want to sweep for minds, meaning that if you don't have to use your computer to focus on your one thing, well, shut off the monitor. Or if you do have to use your computer, why don't you just close down Outlook so you don't get that nice friendly reminder at the lower right-hand corner of your screen that says, oh, I got a new email. I better open that up. And then 45 minutes later, we're still doing email, right? And the final point is to enlist support. Now, I'll tell you that my EA, whose who's office is just right outside my office, if somebody attempts to come up and knock on my door during my one thing time block session, she will literally tackle them. In fact, she's got a one-sentence job description, and she wrote this herself. My one thing is to eliminate all obstacles from Sean's path so that he can focus on his one thing. Wow. So the support is critical. <laughs>